Welcome to One Fit City TV. I'm here with the mayor of Winnipeg, Mayor Brian Bowman. And today we are going to do a breakfast dish. Now, most important meal of the day. And if you miss breakfast, what happens to you? Oh, uh, it's not happy there. <laughs> you know, I, you got to have breakfast. Yeah. And, and quite often, if I am rushing, uh, if I get to City Hall and I haven't eaten, I'm scrambling to get something. Yeah. I mean, you got to eat. Absolutely. Yeah. And this is something where more people need to put the, we've said it a million times, mm -hmm. it is the most important meal. And people aren't saying that just because it's the most important meal you should skip. It's because mm -hmm. doing something simple and easy is critical. So what I'm going to show people, a very important fact, oatmeal, great base to the start of your day. Now, two thirds of a cup of oatmeal is gonna run you almost 300 calories. And this is where we find a lot of problems with people is they will say, I'm eating healthy, why am I not losing weight? And it's very simple. If you look at this and look at how little there is there, mm -hmm. if you were to double that, that's what most people will have as a breakfast serving of oatmeal. And you got 600 calories right there. So mm -hmm. critical to the success of a weight loss plan is measuring out your food. So what we're going to do is two thirds of a cup into the blender. Then from there, egg whites. Egg whites. And simple on this just to fill it up this is to taste i don't really measure my egg whites because you're looking at uh about half a cup is going to be about 100 calories a little more than that more yeah and that's good right there okay. also if you are an athlete then you want that little extra bit of protein you can add it there and if you're somebody that's just kind of you know you like a thicker pancake and all that a little less and away you go now the fruit i'm using raspberries in this if I had a plan better in my life, I would have had strawberries that were fresh picked. And you were telling me a story before we got into this about your kids going strawberry picking. Yeah, well, I mean, uh, we went out to a place near Stonewall uh, this last year. There's great, there's great places all over the province. Um, but we uh, we went out and had a, a, an amazing day just out picking strawberries. And then we ended up, uh, what we do is we, we, we seal them just in some zip, Ziploc bags, put them in the freezer in single portions, and then we use them for smoothies during the week. And... Uh, uh, the kids love them because they, they pick them. Uh, we love them because they're healthy, they're local. It's it's great. It's it's convenient. And as local as you can be on a regular basis, that's what you want to do. You yep. get more nutrients that way, and it's yeah. it's a great it's a great way to support the local economy as well. Absolutely. So, quick little half cup. We'll do, and then adding it to the mix. I won't use all of those because it's a lot. And then from there, we just quickly buzz it. By the way. This is a pro tip right here. Spend money on a good blender. You, yeah. It's, it's yeah. something where I cannot stress enough. You need a good blender in your house, otherwise you get frustrated with cooking. And if you get frustrated, things go bad quickly. Non-stick pan, also another good investment. Mm -hmm. So I'm just gonna quickly zip this. All right, so that's done. And what we're gonna quickly do from here is just put this into, like I was saying, a good non-stick pan. I, I bought this Lagostina pan, I don't want to say 10 or 15 years ago, and it has been with me everywhere I've ever gone, and it is unbelievably good. Pour that on. Do you put any, uh, do you put any oil or anything in the pan? Just I usually don't, not with this one. Yeah. I can't, like, I cannot stress how good this pan is yeah. and how easy it is to go. It's great. Then from there, on to heat. Cook it like a pancake. I'm not going to give you cooking instructions. That's, that's a whole different series, but from there, your final product will look like this. Absolutely delicious. Uh, you can top it with honey. You can top it with maple syrup. Canadian product. You know, yep. Great for us. That is going to last you your whole day. And that's going to be an excellent source of fuel for the body. Protein, carbohydrates, good fats. And that's your One Fit City Quick Fit tip. Thanks to Mayor Brian Bowman. That's your pancake. Eat it in your diet. Enjoy it.